what's up my beauties Asher Bot and jeans here with a very fun fun video on tags woo I know everybody's doing a tag video but you know what why not jump on the train right so my tag video is the scariest things tag Ooh, I know super scary right anyway let's just jump right into the questions okay question number one scariest real life experience okay um right after high school i was driving home from a party with my mom and my two aunts and we had stopped at a red light when all of a sudden these guys in i think they were like obama masks i don't know they were really scary <laughs> masks came up and started pounding on the windows of the car next to us. Yeah, it was super scary. <laughs> so my mom was like, drive, drive, drive. And the light turned green and we never looked back. And I don't actually think I've been back to that neighborhood since. Yeah. Okay, question number two. Scariest paranormal experience. Okay, those who know me know that I am a big believer in the paranormal which yeah it's kind of like not something I usually admit so much until now I guess anyway so there was one night I was home alone in this one house that was really scary like during the daytime so at night it was just uh, gave me creeps <laughs> and my bedroom was downstairs right so I'm sitting there and I'm doing my homework and I hear footsteps upstairs and I'm like, oh, mom's home. And so I go upstairs and I'm like, mom, mom, where are you? Yeah, no one was there. It was scary. And so I just went back downstairs to my room and started doing my homework again. And then I heard footsteps again and I was like, oh oh crap like is this really happening to me so I went back to upstairs again and mom wasn't home again so needless to say I went back downstairs shut my door and locked it and I didn't go outside of my room again until the next morning it was it was just this really creepy experience um Question number three, have I ever known anyone convicted of a violent crime? No, I don't think so. I know that there was someone I worked with who had an ankle bracelet, but I don't know if it was for a violent crime or anything like that. Um, question number four, are you afraid of the dark? Why or why not? I don't know if I'm afraid of the dark so much as I am, I know, cliche, cliche sounding, as, as I'm afraid of what is in the dark or what I might see in the dark. Because like I said, I'm a big believer in the paranormal, so if there's a completely dark room, that kind of freaks me out a little bit because I'm not sure about not sure about like what I might see or what I might hear so I guess the answer to that question is no um question number five does your hometown have any scary stories or legends I know about one this is in a cemetery in downtown Salt Lake where there's a certain grave that you go to and I believe light a candle at and you're supposed to be able to see the ghost of a scary ch or of a little girl that died um I don't know the details on that I'll have to really look it up and figure that out which I don't know uh question number six what is my favorite urban legend I really really like the one about the ghost on the side of the road 
think it's a female ghost that walks along the side of the road in a certain town and she's hitchhiking and so a guy stops to pick her up she gives him directions to a house that's abandoned and then when he gets there he looks over at the passenger seat and she's either gone or she just says thank you gets out of the car and then walks into the house and there's no one there i think that one's really fun and cool to listen to it kind of gives you the the creeps um question number seven what is my scariest nightmare <sighs> okay I have a little sister who is a certified nursing assistant and so I have nightmares all the time about something major happening where she runs in to help people who have been hurt and ends up getting killed in the process. Yeah, so those, those, that's my scariest nightmare, and I really hate having those. Um, if we're talking more about paranormal nightmares, I don't really have those as much, which is unfortunate, because I'm sure I'd have some really cool paranormal nightmares. So, alright guys, that's it for the scariest thing tag. Don't forget to check out my girl Acorn's channel, who is also doing a scariest thing tag i will have her link or her channel link in the description below and don't forget to subscribe and i'll miss you what a bitch just, i was just being rude for the sake of being rude because i'm drunk i don't actually mean that confirmed y'all emily hates me